here is one of our uh, induction motor installed in our company uh, this setup is very common as you can see this is uh, compressing air suction from one side from here it is sucking air and then it is compressing air this is fan so it is compressing air and flowing to the top to the air slide these air slide fans are very common in industry i will show you some detail of this one here you can see uh, this is the mechanical side nameplate uh, here this one is the model number for this one and this is centrifugal fan of course you can see and this chinese made so here is some manufacturer date uh, the volume is there and this one is you can see in cubic meter per hour this is the capacity and here is the uh, whatever the pascal uh, for this fan how much pressure it is building uh, so some 5000 pascal uh, and then this is um, some 80 degrees celsius and here another detail you can see the spinning speed 2900 rpm uh, the motor model uh, you can see over here it is written but it is not written because motor they don't know uh, which motor they will install and here is the date um, for the manufacturing 2019 and month is of course august uh, in which it had been made and here is some serial number they have telephone number sorry they have given for this company the manufacturer um, here is the motor part and this motor part is electrical as you know uh, so this one is 380 volt lv motor and this is star connect uh, delta connected and this is 7.5 kilowatt seven and a half kilowatt um, and 14.9 ampere is the current as you know there is a rule of thumb is if the frequency is 50 hertz uh, the rule of thumb is um, the current will be simply double of the kilowatts so here if the kilowatt is 7.5 so some 15 ampere is coming which is 14.9 in this case and here you see some diagram uh, this is star and this is delta so these two diagrams they have given either you can run in star or in delta this is delta connected and it is written over here uh, the delta connection and this is of course uh, s1 duty cycle motor i with ingress protection ip55 mm, then insulation class is f you can see it is written and 2900 is the rpm for this cos phi our power factor is 0 0.886 which is better power factor for this motor and efficiency nana is you can see 88.1 percent which is not not very good for such a motor if it will, would be some way uh, 90 above 90 percent then these are considered to be good but 88 is also okay it is accepted and the lwo all our noise level for this while it is running is some 79 decibel they have written over here and uh, this one uh, this thing is not very common and this one is the weight 69 kgs and i am b you can see this has been written over here three uh, so this detail is there three phase induction motor you can see this is of course induction motor now we are coming to the terminal box as the, you can see these three um, plates or jumpers or whatever these bus bars they are connected in one line and you will connect three phase supply over here so the, while it is in one line it means that this is uh, delta connected and if it is connected on one side and in, on another side you are supplying power then it is star but this one is delta as you can see in this case as these uh, plates are connected um, in line uh, you know del why delta connection is uh, here the terminal box cover also is showing these connections these are labeled and the delta connection is shown over here uh, there is a diagram you can see for delta over here on this terminal box covering mm, and this diagram is showing star connection if these were we would be here these uh, jumpers or whatever uh, these bus bars so this, this this would be star connected but now in this case it is delta connected mm, so why delta connection is because we are obtaining much more power three phases will be connected over here on these terminals in the delta connection we are we are taking much more power from one motor and in star connection we are taking less power as this this is you know very well very well from the motor theory but you know uh, higher uh, voltage motors they are normally uh, star connected and lower voltage motor like this one is they are connected in delta so delta motors are providing they are capable of providing much more power in one 
uh, size or n1 capacity uh, so this detail enough detail i have provided in this video hopefully this video will be a guideline for you and you will like it if you like it press on like subscribe my channel press on the bell icon and uh, press on all so then you will get all my notifications thank you for watching